Hi YouTubers, how are you today? I hope everyone is well. Today I'm gonna show you how to make an easy dressing. The holiday is coming up, Easter, and if you want a million dollar dressing for Easter, let's make this one. It's easy, simple, and delicious. I have some ingredients here. My son made some cornbread for me and he did such a great job on it. I have some celery and onions cut up. I have a can of cream of mushroom soup, a can of cream of chicken soup. I beat one egg. I have poultry seasoning also. And on that plate, guys, I have lorry seasoning, salt, onion powder, garlic powder, sage, parsley. Go over these ingredients again. Lorry seasoning, salt, onion powder, garlic powder, sage. I have paprika and some parsley, dry parsley there, and a little bit of sea salt. Now, what I have is some bread here, and I'm gonna break it up all the way down real fine as I can get it. That's what I'm gonna do with this bread, okay? I'm gonna break this down, and I'm gonna come back and put all the ingredients into my dressing. Over here, guys, I have some chicken, smoked turkey parts, not chickens, forgive me. Those are smoked, and I'm gonna use some of that um, turkey juice there to put into my dressing, okay? So let me beat all of this bread together, fine as I can get it, and I'll come right back. All right, guys, I'm back. And see this cornbread? You wanna get it fine. Now, I'm gonna give you measurements for the cornbread so that you can make this cornbread from scratch if you want to, okay? That's what I'm gonna do. And make sure you crumble it up well. And I'm gonna give you the measurements to the seasoning. I'm making quite a bit of it because I'm sharing dinner with my neighbors today. And everybody's waiting on this, okay? So I'm definitely gonna make this easy million dollar dressing the best to my ability today. With all the love that I have. Okay, we put all our seasonings in here so far. Now I'm gonna go in with a cup of the broth from the turkey. And I'm gonna put in my cream of mushroom and cream of celery. I'm gonna go in with all of that. I am gonna show you another recipe later on how to make dressing. But this is the million dollar dressing here that you can't go wrong with. Go wrong with. Okay. Then you're gonna put those celeries and onions in there. If you choose to saute it, you can. My grandmother used to saute her onions and celery first. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with my onions and my celery, okay? All right, guys, you see this? This is what it's looking like. But remember, I'm giving you measurements just for a regular million dollar dressing. I'm gonna have to go in with some more of my broth. And I'm gonna mix it in. And the last thing I'm going to put in is my egg. I want to make sure that this is moist and delicious. Okay. I have some of this chicken um, bouillon cube. It's not a cube. It's the powder. And I'm going to go in with this. but it all will be listed in my description box. Okay. And I'm gonna put my egg in and I'm using poultry seasoning along with my sage. You don't have to use the poultry season. 
but I am. Okay, so I'll list this as optional in my ingredients because I love poetry seasoning. My grandmother loves sage and I did use sage, but I'm using poetry seasoning also. Okay, I wanna get this just a little taste. Okay. And I think it's fine. So I'm going to go ahead, make sure you beat your egg first, and then put it into your dressing. Okay, I'm going to put this into my skillet, or I may use my pan. I'm gonna put this in there and I'll be right back. Make sure you mix it well. All right, you wanna butter whatever you use, your cast iron skillet, your whatever pan you use, make sure you butter it or oil it down. I put butter in mine. I'm gonna put the dressing in. All right, this is what your dressing should be looking like, your million dollar dressing. Okay, we're gonna put this in the oven on 350 to 375, you know your oven, for 45 minutes to an hour is what you wanna do. I am gonna sprinkle some dry parsley on the top of mine. I'm gonna put it in the oven and I'll be right back. All right guys, I'm back. This stayed in 55 minutes. Now it's really up to you, you know how your oven is, if you want it dry or moist in the inside of it. But this is what we have here. Look at that. Look at that dressing. Doesn't that look amazing? So I'm going to have cabbage today, guys. Dressing and baked chicken is what I'm having today. If you enjoyed this video, Give me a thumbs up, guys. I'm, I put some on a plate for my neighbor. But I'm going to go in. I like those crusty edges. And I'm going to taste it. Mm. Awesome. This is absolutely delicious, guys. Try this video. You can add a bag of stove top stuffing to this. I'm gonna show you guys another recipe soon on how to make dressing, but this tastes absolutely delicious. You guys have an awesome day. God bless everyone week. Voila, bye-bye.